Oysters are like the coral reefs in the Caribbean. They're absolutely essential to the ecosystem called the Chesapeake Bay. Will Baker, president of the Chesapeake Bay Foundation, says an effort like this is long overdue. A partnership of more than 20 organizations, businesses, nonprofits, and educational institutions to help add 10 billion oysters to the bay by 2025. The University of Maryland is one of those institutions which has the capacity to produce about 2 billion. This is a challenge, uh, but uh, we, we have the capacity to do it. We have the know-how to do it. And if we use the science that we're now generating and have, we, we are very confident that this will be successful. So how do you do it? How do you add 10 billion oysters to the Chesapeake Bay? Well, it's a variety of things. It has to do with funding, a volunteer effort, science, and regrowing the oyster industry here in Maryland. And that is key to oyster watermen like Johnny Shockley, who says it could be huge for the industry if it's a success. As for every one they harvest, two will be put back into the ecosystem. It's gotten real, very difficult to survive. And one of the biggest reasons for that is because we lost the foundation of our industry when we lost our oyster industry. What we need to do is rebuild that new, that new foundation. The biggest hurdle may be getting the right funding. For more information on how you can help, visit our website at WBALTV.com. In Annapolis, I'm Lowell Melser, WBAL TV 11 News.